Come on. Boy. Out there, mister. Are you doing all you can? Huh? Use your... <coughs> use your strength to help the weak. Yep. Look out! Hello. Come on, please. You must be new to town. There's a little nook there if you need something for your camp. Looks like you travel a lot, so worth having a look and see. Ain't no other outfit beats their prices. Good doing business with you. Can I get you anything else? Look around. Mister? Hello! Mister, how about we skip the small talk, eh?
Come on.
Come on. Whoa, easy, boy. Okay, boy. Yeah. Okay, boy. Let's go. Yep.
okay? Okay.
Jesus. Almost a meal there. Here. Wait. Yep. Let's go. Stay here. It's okay. Shh. 
Cheesy now. Easy now. Nice and easy. Stay calm. Just getting this off you, boy. Let's go, girl. Not bad, girl. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Get going, boy. Go on, boy. Okay, girl. Yep. Easy, girl. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, good girl. Hey, you're okay, girl. Take long. <laughs> you did real good.
camp, stranger. I don't mean no harm, okay? Just want to speak to Hernandez. We don't take two visitors up here. Flacco Hernandez, you in there? I didn't want trouble, but I'm just here to speak with you. About Boy Calloway? I'm unarmed. <coughs> I just want to talk. About Boy Calloway? Sure. Here's your message.
doing good, girl.
Come on, follow me. Yeah.
Good girl. Yeah. donation coming from this boy here. Stay right where you are. Get on down here. Oh, you really chose the wrong mark today. Hey, boys, put him down. <coughs> Pearson? The big man! How are you doing? Very well. Okay, good. Whatever you say. A stew without good meat is no stew at all, Mr. Morgan. Fine, but make sure you get a good price for it. Now this I can work with. Good, we really needed this. This is a decent pal. Well done, Mr. Morgan. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. I've come up with some ideas for ways we could improve things around here if you want to take a look. Just because I have standards? Keep my eye out for some... I began to tumble and roar. <coughs> My face is red like a lobster. I fell and broke my poor knobster. 
Uh, watch from my uh, father. Mr. Morgan. Picture. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Uh, Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. Yeah. He's looking at a few business yeah. things there. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> He'll find something, to too. Try. He always does. I'll well, you be well, now, Mr. Morgan. I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. Hold a drink. Susan. I'll deny it. Thanks for all your efforts. The alehouse door. That is where they tell us to meet all the jolly good fellas. Good night by the poker and fellas. How little drunk anymore. Good morning, Arthur. You'll work it out, Dutch. You always do. You keep your eyes open, Bill. Good morning, Arthur. Managing not to annoy folks? Very funny. Because if you ain't, it must be a lifetime first. I'll give it a rest, Morgan. Doing good, girl.
damn lock. Mister, oh, give me the help. damn key. Hey.
Please help me out of here. Oh, oh, thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. It's all right, ma'am. It's over now. Thank you. Again. Poor woman. Howdy. You're just a waste of time. Okay, okay. Keep your hair on. Hey, wait a second. No way I'm stopping for you. I said stop, damn it. Mr. 
there, mister. Just calm down. Interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work mm -hmm. in the right way. Well, they all say that. I never met an idiot that called himself one. Very true. In that case, I'm an idiot. But I know how to get things done efficiently. Arthur, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur! Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmen de Dell. That's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> Let's go. Really? Really. Just get on the horse. Easy. Make this difficult. Just what? shut up, damn it. Okay, I need to say anything because I've already forgotten. All right, there. Let's go. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Arthur, what's wrong now?
back here. Now, look, stranger, you really... Don't you test me. Why don't hey, you just... think of it. I'll, I'll keep my tongue still here. You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Well, clearly you've recovered from your bear encounter. This works. Come on, Hosea. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches? That's easy money for me. <laughs> Got some blood on you just there. Move out the damn way. So, you were saying? A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches? That's easy money for us. Damn it. Anyway, what, what you were talking about? I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. So what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? Find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange. Hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Stay, girl. This way, girl. We can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's wait. Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all fine.
What are you making a noise for? Just get on the coach and let's go. Come on. Get on and let's head back. Just waiting on you, Arthur. What are you playing? Just get on the damn coach. into the barn there. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Nah, I'll catch up with you later. Okay. Stay out of trouble.
Come on, girl. Hey there! Hey, mister! Y'all plotting something here? Hey, you best be getting, unless you want to get friendly. That's with tough talk, but I.
Get out of here. Go on. Try and take me out again. See where it gets you. Hello again. Gentle with that. Trust me. Good choice. I just hope nobody's missing this too much. Got a little kick show in mind, huh? I trust nobody's missing this. You're all right, girl. Okay, girl. There, girl. Let's go, girl. Yep. Easy.
Easy there. Good haul there, girl. Yep. Could really use some good meat for this stew. Fine, but make good sure job. you get a good price for it. There he is. Mr. Morgan. Look, everything's gonna be all right. That's my boy. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Okay. Hello, Arthur. 
Hi, Pearson. Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there. Badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. Goes without saying. Oh, what am I gonna do? You're gonna suffer. <laughs> and life's gonna go on. That's the truth of it. I, I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. Where, where am I gonna go? Stay here with us. Oh, hey. So ah, Mr. Morgan. You ain't out of it again, are you? I resent the ah, Mr. Morgan. You seem chipper. But where there's light, there's hope, my friend. Yeah. Hosea. Need a hand with your horse? Sounds good. Oh, <laughs> Shit. Girl.
Hey there, can I have a word? What do you need from me? It's all good, calm down. Well, I guess that's over with now. I should do the world a favor and put you down anyway. You're dead! Don't this make you. this difficult. Someone gonna hey, die. Think about this. Ever see a man die? This to ain't a, a discussion. I'm pushing you off the track. I like you much better, Dad. <laughs> said a word just feels like we ain't getting nowhere it's the end of the century it's seems like we ain't much further on than we was in 65 yeah maybe maybe not we can still hey there I like a story anyone Stories for you, fellas.
Easy, girl. Hey, you're okay, girl. Hey, mister. Hey, sir. Mister, I've been trapped down here. Why are you dressed up like that? <laughs> I've seen some sick perversions in my time, but this one might take the prize. Wait, wait. You've got to help me. It's that crazy gunsmith. He made me dress up like this. He's got me chained to the goddamn foot. You gotta do something, please. He's never gonna let me go. Why, hello. Don't think I've seen you before. If it's a gun you're after, you'll want to take a look in the catalog and see what catches your eye. Whoa, now. That's a fool decision. I want to see what's in that basement of yours. Show me. Right now. Nothing to no worse down there, I swear. Well, why don't I be the judge of that? Open it now. All right, all right. I ain't got nothing to hide. Got my boy sleeping down there. It's such a shame to wake him. You know, you could always come back after he wakes up. You, you just stay away from me. Now, what I tell you about talking to your pa that way? Oh, oh, thank God. He can't see. I only do it for his own good. Just. What the hell is going on here? He was being a bad little boy, stealing candy from the store again. It's for his own good. I'm not your little boy, you mad son of a bitch. Why are you wearing that sailor suit? That crazy maniac put me in it. He thinks I'm his kid's son. Kidnapped me, he did. Do I look like a kid? <laughs> Always in such a rush to grow up these days, aren't they? You're not gonna help me? Just take anything you want. Just leave us in peace. I'm never getting out of here, am I? Take anything you want. Just don't harm my boy. Don't shoot me, please. Just, just leave us be. <laughs> oh, oh, finally. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh you, you I'm sick sorry. Son of a... Please forgive me. I know it was wrong. I just couldn't face that he was gone. I was teaching Sammy how to hold the rifle proper out by the river. The recoil shot him backwards. He slipped into the river. The water pulled him downstream so quick. It all happened so fast, I didn't know what to do. I searched up and down that river bank for days. But I couldn't find my boy. I just miss him so much. And you? You remind me of him. You look just like him. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Guess he deserved it.
no need to cover your face. Idiot. gotta be such a goddamn moments with you now i told you i'd get you the money and i'll get it if you didn't make it this week who's to say you'll make it next don't you take that tone with me i thought you said you loved I me i do i do lily where's our money what that loan you took it's payday i'm sorry I don't have it right now. Well, then, I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn money. Son of a bitch.
deal, that. It's a dick. Oh, damn it. Can a man have some peace? Hey, stop! Hey, now, let's this all take a, a minute here. What is Don't you doing? test me! Hey, hey, I don't even remember what I need to forget! Can I give you a ride somewhere? Chick Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh, that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. Now, come on. You make me go much further, I'll get more than a debt off you.
Yeah, you're okay, girl. here. That's a fine steed. Got some stable space for rent if you're interested. You know, a horse can tell when you're using a cheaper saddle. You're gonna feel the difference, trust me. That's the same one I use too. Oh yeah, that's a smart choice for your saddle. Yeah, that'll go real well with the saddle. I can't tell you how many times I use that one. I appreciate it. That's the same one I use too. You're the type who likes to stand out, huh? All right. No harm in gussying your horse up. Got a fancy streak, huh? A drink and then go see your wife. Yeah, I heard that too. Having fun, mister? <laughs> you be careful there, partner. You seem a little tipsy. Morning to
see you. So, what are you aiming for today? Hey, beautiful condition. Keep it up. You thought about upgrading the stock? I got some nice ones. You'll be very pleased with this. Smart addition. It does seem strange to me that they'd need so many guards of Cornwall, kerosene, and tar. Must be something else going on there. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. We can do a lot with this. New trigger, brand new bolt. Your pick. I bet this will shoot better with some new sights. Dangerous. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. You know what? I bet I can make this piece work a lot better for you. Bolts, triggers, parts, back here. You wanna make this really yours? Give it a personal engraving. Oh, wait, you're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfields? <sighs> yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Eh, fair enough. Neither's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? Uh-huh, go ahead. Fine piece. How about you get some new sights for this, huh? We can do a lot with this. New trigger, brand new bolt, your pick. Carry it with pride. I got some nice carved stocks here. I think you should take one. I sold my old blunderbuss to a bounty hunter last week. <laughs> that boy's out looking to get someone, that's for sure.
You know what? Bet you you could use some rifling on this thing. Smile on your face, guaranteed. You know what? I bet I can make this piece work a lot better for you. Bolts, triggers, parts, back here. You'll love it. We can do a lot with this. New trigger, brand new bolt, your pick. Yep, this is the one. I do quite a lot of blacksmith work in here, too. Don't mind the clutter. Huh. Mmm. Uh-huh. Good, good. Very nice. So long. My wife claims a goat. Back to it, man. Morning. Come on, my girl. Boys, you pay the O'Driscoll mm -hmm. boys. Hey, I made it right quit this you damn well, foolishness. Well, then. What you I staring guess you at? You forgot Move about along. the interest. <clears throat> Looks like you need a lesson. Let's do O'Driscoll <clears throat> proud. <clears throat> this is it. Keep them coming. One of you hit me, damn it. <laughs> Every one of us will drink. <laughs> <laughs> Should have walked away. You all right? You might have just saved my life, stranger. You're a gentleman. They won't bother you no more. <laughs> if, if only there was more men like you and less of them damn O'Driscolls. I'm, I'm, I'm going to see to my ailings. Thank you, Mr. Really. Back for some more provisions. Got everything you need. Have a look. Everything in that is available for purchase. Taking a shine to that, huh?
Old Miss Hardshaw, the seamstress, passed away. Don't know who's gonna mend my things now. You like the look of that one, huh? All right. That's mighty popular these days. Those go pretty fast. I hear the old cuss that owns the stables got into a hell of a fuss with his old lady. Appreciate it. Seem a bit taken with that. Being the main store in town, people come to depend on you. Careful playing cards in this town. Some real cheaters around here. Okay, then. I sell out of that pretty fast. Good choice, good choice. Thank you.
That's mighty popular these days. It's all yours. Those go pretty fast. Enjoy. That's mighty popular these days. Nice. Good doing business with you. Thank you. I'll let you look around some more. It is Thanks, partner. That we receive the true gifts of life that are eternal. <laughs> so give generously, for that is what this country needs to help each other. Remember, <coughs> remember, it's better to give than to receive. <coughs> manage are you doing all you can huh use your <coughs> use your strength to help the weak come on please please somebody be generous show your care come on please somebody back so soon let me see. Well, it's always here if you want to take another look. Like Lady Money on Thank you for your help. Your pocket's deep enough. She'll share a Give bit. Give more! First, Please! Prove we ain't a land of savages. Prove we're here for each other. It is in giving that we receive the true gifts of life. 
life that are eternal. See you back. <laughs> will be served in this town today. All right, but no one's not. Can you believe that? It is in giving that we receive the true gift of life that are eternal. <laughs> Forget to buy something? Thank you. Really. Hello, mister. Hello. Uh, you. Mister, excuse me. We don't hey, need mister. need more trouble from you here. Hey there. What do you want? How do you do? Hello, sir. Well, you're just full of charity, ain't you? Well, I'm just trying to help where I can, sir. Or interfere. Hello, <laughs> sir. You, you would have killed that man. What I do is none of your damn business, okay? Okay, okay. <coughs> okay, sir. <coughs> Come on. Let's try and help each other. It's not about, sir. <laughs> Damn game! Girl. Get you anything in there you need. All right, have a think about it. Thank you. Please give money to the orphans. Remember, <coughs> remember, it's better to give than to receive. Forget to buy something? Brotherhood of man. So give what you can. We're in it together. We can be one. We're collecting for an orphanage in San Denis. Please give if you can. <laughs> Something slip your mind? Thanks.
stepping in there. Those bastards been turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. I told them where to stick it, and well, I guess you just saw how that panned out. You watch yourself, all right? Stay out of trouble. Knock, knock, Mr. Robo. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you me, speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. I'm here for money. You borrow from a German man? Aha, uh. German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money, money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh no, no, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to hair Strauss. Pay up! Stop! You nie mam siły. Ah, no, 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 no. Please, no. No have money, but but I have this. It's, it's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's it's Warsaw, yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. Must have come here with something. The longer I look, the madder I get. What you got behind there? So, uh, sorry, Move aside. Don't even speak English. Just like I'm not
the right kinds of dirt. What do we have? What you got behind there? So, uh, surprise, I mean, you don't understand. Move aside. Rusakom, you must not move. I'm not kind of touch. What do we have here? My old bronzka, nie. Just keep quiet. Longer I look, the madder I get. Be something somewhere. You must have come here with some. <laughs> no, no, no. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, that should about cover things.
Look who's back! Hey, Arthur. Miss Karen, all good? Too good. I'd like the chance to shoot a fella and not feel bad about it. Somehow that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> Stay alert. Nice, yes. Arthur, you know, I think we're gonna be okay. Sure, but what next? All that money lost in Blackwater. We have licked our wounds long enough. We do what we do. We make more money, and before they even realize that we're here, we're gonna be gone again. And after that, I ain't losing to these. These fools. Arthur, you know me better than that. We get to work here. We make money, and then we head back out west to freedom. Oh, I ain't wavering, son. The day she left. Me. I had health problems, so I... How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. How you gentlemen keeping? Uh, sorry for interrupting, but I can't stand much longer over there. I mean, I love the girls, but my lord, they complain a lot. I mean, I've known worse than this.
was born into worse than this. Most of us grew up hungry and Come on, girl. Yeah. Quit wasting my time, you bleeding fool. Okay, okay, keep your hair on. Yep. been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh, you poor, dumb animal. Oh. 
What'll I tell Mildred? <sighs> you need a ride home, ma'am? Oh. oh, yes, mister, please. Thank you. Do you know Valentine? I live there. That's cool, girl. No problem. Idiot. travel this far alone, you know. I was off inquiring about a possible new line of work. I I'd borrowed a friend's horse for the trip. See, my husband... Well, it's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. Mm, I'm sure it is. A good opportunity. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, God! Yeah! I was hoping to get a job working as a seamstress. A wealthy man said he'd pay me for the work. Sounds promising. Also doesn't sound real. Slow down, please. Oh, you may be right, I suppose. He said he'd provide room and board for me and for my child. He wanted to meet me first. Well, I'd be careful with offers like that, ma'am. I can't afford to dismiss offers like these, even if they do seem... odd. Just be careful is all I'm saying. I may not uh, have another oh, opportunity mister. like this. Now I'll have to pay Mildred back for her horse. This sure sounds like you're in a hard position. We're here. Thank you for all your help. You're a good man. Glad I was able to help. You take care. Appreciate it. You'll be well. Ma'am... Will you be all right from here? I'll find my way. Thank you, sir. I'll see you yeah, you're all right, girl. Yeah, hey, you're okay, girl. It's all right, girl. Won't take long. That's it! Come on, the girl. Hey, move it! Yep. All right. Let's go, girl. Yeah.
there, friend. Come. Stop on by for a moment. The name's William. Arthur. You familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Familiar ain't quite the word I'd use. Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants all across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all, to know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. But I'm only one man. Would you consider helping me with gathering herbs for my studies? Why? Knowledge, kindness, beauty. Well, I'm ignorant, ugly, and nasty. <laughs> well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. I'm looking for a plant called yarrow. You can distinguish it by its red flowers. It shouldn't be too hard to find. Thrive out in the open under direct sunlight. <laughs> Let's see how this tastes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel better already. They were right. This stuff does have medicinal properties. All this help, you deserve something in return. Well, this is for your horse. This can cure almost all maladies to your animal, natural uh, and otherwise. Don't ask how. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be getting back to my studies. I look forward to our next meeting, Traveler. I can see why you do this. All the best to you. Thanks, Arthur. A and to you.
Why don't you put that back in his holster, huh? You're back. Go on, have yourself a quick nosy. It's worth buying. I'll buy it. Looks like that's that. Hmm. Now where did you get this, I wonder? Oh, yes. People lose these all the time. Been a pleasure doing business with you. Bye. Stay safe and quiet now. Prison transport, keep clear. This isn't right. Let me out of here. It weren't my fault. I don't deserve to be locked up. Like we haven't heard that before. Boom. Now, you've used up my patience. Come on, please. Let me Whoa, out of here. I don't want trouble. Oh, just shut up. Easy. Hey, partner. Hello.
Yep. Yeah. Decent hunt, girl. Hey, Bill. <clears throat> Morning, Mr. Morgan. Hey, Pearson. What do you think? This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Given the circumstances. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. Many thanks, Good morning. Mr. Morgan. Will lead to more repercussions? Eventually, yeah, but like I said, we will keep moving. Look, well, ahead in East Dutch, there's not so many places to hide this way. We will think of something. We always do. You always do. I need you strong now, my brother. I'm trying.
Good morning, Arthur. Marston. I've come up with some ideas for ways we could improve things around here if you want to take a look. Miss O'Shea. Dutch. Thank you, Mr. Pearson. Hi, Molly. Hi. Hosea, how are you? How are you today, Arthur? How did we end up over this way? Huh? Oh, Mr. Morgan! I've jotted down a few things that I think could be uh, nice additions around here. Mr. Matthews. Reverend! I made rather a fool of myself again. Remember, you won't find Me something too. like this anywhere Me else. Me too. It's just... It's so embarrassing. It happens. After Bessie passed away, I was drunk for a year. I wouldn't worry too much about it. You know something? I was married once. Thanks, Pearson. Only it turns out that she was already married. So I was party to bigamy. Just another sin to add to my list. What happened? The law caught up with us in San Francisco. She jumped aboard a ship and sailed to Shanghai, I believe. I suppose I still am married in a way, but it hasn't been terribly fulfilling. No. I suppose not. Arthur? Oh, my. 
Another morning. Hello, Abigail. Good morning. How are you, Hosea?
Get yourself out of there. I ain't here to cause trouble. You goddamn idiot. I'm talking. You always this intrusive? Ain't wise. Uh <laughs>
usually kindly to company, but you can stay. Been doing some hunting, I see. Rare game's more my thing these days. Any fool can take down a deer or a rabbit, even a bear. I once killed 30 bears in one year. And buffalo? <laughs> I can't even count that high. Well, now. Yep, God's honest truth. Folk near San Denis tell stories of a panther that roams the swamps out there. Fast, ferocious, real elusive. Bit of a legend in those parts. Never been caught. And I figure if anyone's gonna do it, it's gonna be me. And a pelt like that ooh, could keep a feller warm in whiskey for months. But that's a story for another day. Hold on now. I, I swear I seen your face before. No, nah, I don't think so. Go darn it, no. Can't get through nothing without something. Damn Come right. on, girl. Yep. Bye now. Hey, mister. Take long, girl. Hey, you're okay, girl. Easy, girl. There, girl. Medicina! Ya para qué? No puedo.
Hi there, mister. Let's go, girl. again.
Pearson. Hello, Arthur. You seem in a good mood. I do. Just make sure it goes into the pot and not your pocket. Thank you, Arthur. This camp could do with a few improvements. Why don't you take a look at my ideas? Better go lot down. Thanks, Mr. Pearson. Months have passed, Lorena. Since last held that hand in mine, fell. Hold me fast, Lorena. Don't mind. Be faster, far than I. Months will fly. been out so fast there is a future oh thank god of life this is so small part this dust the dust beneath the sun I've come up with some ideas for ways we could improve things around here if you want to take a look.
I'm sleepy. Need a hand there? Hey, careful how you go. Can't you see I'm tracking game here? Yep, she's laying a good trail. Okay, sure. Good luck. I thought I saw you over there. Hey, what the hell are you doing?
Let's see what we got. Got a good head start on me. All right, girl. Yeah. Reckon I got a waste. Oh. Must be close. Come on, the girl. Yeah. Okay, girl.
Mister. Right, let's see. Once in a lifetime, eh? Thank you. Hats and gloves made to measure! That's fire. Mind if I warm my bones? <laughs> Y'all knew this was Murphy Hills. You should be careful where you're camping. I can look after myself. Besides, it's a free country. Free country? <laughs> no. Everything bought and paid for. <laughs> and we don't protect what's ours. Y'all be careful where you wander. Come on, let's go. I think you got the message. Go kill you next time. Mm -hmm. I can't where I want to.
You're back. After a little tchotchke, are we? I trust nobody's missing this. So I thought you were just gonna rob the Crawfords. Sounds like it went a good deal further than that. I thought he was just your cousin by marriage. And your competition. Well, yes, but still. Anyway, no point in dwelling on the past, I suppose. Now, I presume this ain't just a social call? If you've been struggling to sell a little something, all right, not a word, yep. Wagner, nor no one else. Yeah. Let's go. Even Micah washes the blood off Morgan. Tilly. Hey.
All right. Arthur. How are things? Marvelous! All right. So, how's it going? Very good. Good. Very nice. We should get top dollar for this. Good job, Mr. Morgan. How are you on space in that bag of yours, Mr. Morgan? Just let me know if you need me to make you a new one. You know, Arthur, I can always make you a new satchel if you hide on space. What? <laughs> what? What does that say? I don't know. Craggy and Jerry. I said I don't know. Hey, easy, girl. No, you won't do it. You sure it's wrong with Will, KMD. You No, he did it in his room. Will is the one who got him caught. Easy, girl. Come on, girl. Bill. Hey, Arthur. Yep. Would you be interested in some friendly competition? I've come all the way north from Mexico to challenge a real American gunslinger. You him? Me? A real gunslinger? <laughs> Let's find out. Okay, man. That's what I like to hear. Look, man, rules are simple, okay? Whoever shoots more of these bottles, wins. Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready, all right? <laughs> Shoot! How the hell did you beat me, huh? Oh. Better shot, I suppose. Oh, that didn't make me happy at all. How about we raise the stakes, huh? All right, let's do it. Aha, uh -huh. that's a good call, amigo. All right, real simple. First one to hit four flying birds wins. Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah, there they go. Shoot! Oh, man. Stupid, stupid. Ah, uh, uh, so you can shoot, huh? Ah, uh, here it is, okay? Man of my word. Appreciate it. Sure. <sighs> Better watch out next time. You'll see. Just not your day, huh? Yeah, I guess not. Guess I need more practice, huh? Yeah. 